Welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year. If you are new to my channel, my name is Kiara K. For those returning back to my channel, thanks for coming back to watch my videos. If you aren't subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notifications so you don't miss uploads from me. And this video is going to be about how to start a YouTube channel. It is a New Year's 2021. 2020 was crazy. 2020 was like a balance for me. It was like a lot of chaos going on, but it was a lot of great things happening for me as well. 10K last year, 2020. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to take the steps in starting your YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna be talking about the first steps you have to take. These are the basic steps that I get asked a lot in the basic steps that you should be doing, but some people aren't doing because they're unaware. So these are those steps, and I do have five steps or tips that I can give to you guys today. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave some love. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. The first thing that I have on um, how to start a YouTube channel is going to be, you need to create a YouTube account. You may already have a email with a Gmail account, but you need to create a YouTube account. And you can, uh, with your email, you can like and subscribe to other people's channels, but you actually need to go in and turn your channel into a YouTube account or a YouTube creator or content creator. I don't know what it's called, but you need to make sure you transform your account to a YouTube account so that way you can upload. Make sure you know what your channel name is. Create a channel name that stands out, something that aligns with yourself. So just make sure it's something that you're gonna wanna stick with over the time of your channel growth. Also wanna make sure you have all the small behind the scene things done. So to make sure you have everything as far as your channel art, uh, make sure you have a really, really nice, I don't know, avatar profile picture, whatever you call it on YouTube. Make sure you have a nice picture. It's something that somebody will know that that is you if they see that little icon. Cause you know like how it is when you see like your favorite YouTubers and you know exactly what their picture look like. I have tried to stop changing mine as much. That way like it's more familiar. Um, so yes, you wanna make sure you have a nice picture. You also wanna make sure you have your YouTube channel art, YouTube banner, um, in your YouTube intros and outros. I do have a few videos on how to make a YouTube intro on my channel. I also have some free intro templates on my channel. I will list them down below so you guys can check them out if you are starting a new channel. Just check them out. If you want to make your own, I have videos on how to make a uh, YouTube intro as well. Um, so yes, I will have those clipped down below. Okay, a YouTube banner, even if it's something very, very basic. When your subscribers come to your channel, they're gonna know that's your channel, that's your personal feel, that's your aesthetics for your channel. Make sure your channel is aesthetically pleasing to your audience, that way they know it's you when they see your work, they know it's you when they post your videos. You wanna make sure everything is all in one the same. I pre, like I said in like a couple of my other videos, I like to have stuff match. I don't really like the mismatchy thing, so everything has to match when it comes to my channel. So that is um, one of the tips that I will give um, when you're starting a new channel. Make sure your banner, intro, all of that stuff match. If you change one, change the other. That way everybody know that it is you. Or the second step to starting a YouTube channel, you need to make sure you have something to film with. Anything that has a camera will work. Okay, you can film with your laptop, you can film with a phone, iPhone, Android, you can film with a camera, you can film with pretty much anything that has a camera on it, you can film with it. Everyone pretty much has a cell phone. If you don't have a cell phone, you have a laptop, use your laptop. If you don't have a laptop and you have a cell phone, use your cell phone. If you have a camera and you're lucky enough to have a camera before you start, use that camera. Use whatever, has, whatever you can film on, use it. You also wanna make sure that your lighting is good. Um, going back to what I just said for um, your cameras and things like that, depending on the camera that you have will determine the type of lighting that you will need because when you're filming with natural lighting, it is best to have like a really, really nice phone with like an HD camera or having um, a camera or something like that. But you just wanna make sure that your lighting is good. You can use ring lights, you can use natural lighting, you can use soft box lights. There are so many ways you can use lights. You can even go to the dollar store and get a white light um, just the white light bulb and put it in your light bulb in your room and you can use that as well Speaking of lighting y'all do not come for me today y'all see this dark shadow on my face So one of my softbox lights went out So I'm filming with one um, not my softbox is my umbrella light one of my umbrella lights went out So I'm filming with one umbrella light and a ring light So this whole side of my face is just like completely shadowed and it's like what is bothering me I'm gonna try and fix it before I upload it, but I don't think it. I mean who cares it's not a makeup tutorial today so it doesn't really matter to me but you just want to make sure your lighting is a bomb and you also want to make sure you have somewhere to film it um you can set up and make up your own setup there's ton of tons of videos on youtube on how to make a youtube setup um 
I would go for, if you don't have a lot of equipment, I would go for the videos with no equipment, how to uh, make your own YouTube setup. Um, me right now filming in front of a wall, you can do that. You can get a backdrop from Walmart. Walmart uh, backdrops um, for two yards is like three and four dollars. You can do that. You can go to Joann's, Michael's, any fabric store and just get fabric. Honestly, if you're doing a sit down video, you're not going to need more than two yards to film your video. Um, the third step on starting your YouTube channel is your editing software. Now for me, I started off using iMovie because I have a iPhone. Um, but now I'm using Final Cut Pro because your girl finally made the upgrade this year. I'm so proud of myself. Final Cut Pro is uh, about $400, but it is worth it because it has all the features that you need. I'm still learning to work a lot of the features, but from what I've learned so far, it is a step up for my iMovie and it's definitely worth it. But if you're starting out, you have an iPhone, you can get iMovie. Make sure you use iMovie, take advantage of it. I do know there are editing softwares for like Windows and Androids as well. I just don't know those personally. You just wanna make sure you look those up if you are an Android user or Windows user. You just wanna make sure you look those up. I'm the fourth step to start a YouTube channel is so you wanna make sure you have video ideas lined up. I mean, go in your notes on your phone, write it down in your notebook, something that you can keep track of. Just write down video ideas. If it pops in your head, write it down. It don't matter if it makes sense or not. Just write it down. You can always twist and tweak and make it your own. You also look up on YouTube video ideas. There's a tons of videos on people giving out video ideas for different times of the year different um different um different categories as far as beauty you could do vlogging video ideas if you're doing pranks anything whatever you're doing for your channel just get some video ideas that stick out to you and something that um appeals to you or applies to your channel just want to make sure you have backup video ideas so that you're not sitting around trying to figure out what you want to do just always have something in the back of your head i can turn that into the video that's how you're going to stay consistent on your channel um the whole entire 2020 that was like the learning lesson for me is to always have a backup video or always have something brewing something that um, I can bounce off of um, just ideas or anything like that that's how I stay consistent in 2020 which helped my channel grow a lot and number five is going to be just start your channel that is the last step that I have just start the channel stop stop procrastinating stop saying oh I don't have this I don't have that just start the channel you will be surprised how long you hold it off and then once you actually start, you're going to realize, I really didn't need all that. I really didn't need all this. I could have just started my channel. And then you're like months behind, years behind because you could have, and you know, and then you think about where could my growth have been if I started my channel two years ago or if I, where I, if I would have started my channel a couple months ago. Like, just start. Just start, see how it goes, practice filming, get comfortable in front of the camera because that is going to be something that is going to be. Um, kind of challenging especially if you have people in the house because I would stutter and mess up on camera what you guys see and what I put on my camera girl I probably stutter in this video like 10 times on the intro no lie like so you just have to get comfortable in front of the camera get comfortable with looking directly into the camera that's another step I that I'm gonna talk more about that in part two so you guys want to make sure you check that out that will be clipped above and down below so you guys can check it out um but yes that is all I have for today's video I hope these beginner steps were helpful to you um if you want a video of me going in detail how to actually start the channel or um if you want more detailed videos on band anything you want more detailed videos on just drop it down below let me know and i will try to help you guys out in the best way that i can um i'm super excited i hope you guys are super excited start that channel girl get it going we'll do it you can do it just most love to your channel all right y'all but that is all i have for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy this video also leave some comments down below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification so you do not miss any uploads from me um but i will see y'all in part two because i'm about to give the teases all of it i will see y'all in my next video thanks so much for watching